Check it out. Check it out. We're going check it out. We lost. It don't matter what quarter it was in, man. We lost. I'm tired of losing. Ah. I don't care if we was down 30 or we lose by 30 or lose by one. Um, we lost, and I don't, I don't, I don't think anybody in here wants to lose. But uh, we got to figure this out <laughs> very, very quickly. It's time to blow it up. He fans, not all of y'all, but a lot of you guys just need to stop with the delusion. This team just isn't that great, and the season is washed. Do Jimmy a favor and trade him in the offseason to a contender before he wastes his prime on a mediocre team. When you have no defense mixed with passive stars, poor shooting, and add terrible contracts and a sprinkle of terrible rotations, you get the Miami Heat. This team and franchise as a whole needs to be shaken up from top to bottom. In my eyes, everyone not named Bam needs to go this offseason. If y'all want to add Hero into that, then that's fine. But we can't keep sitting up here and making it seem as if this is something that can continue. The only reason why Miami is even still in the playoff picture is because every team behind them is just as bad or worse. And they just managed to win just a few more games than the others. This team has now lost four straight and are locked into the seventh seed and are looking to be a first round exit and are heading towards the play-in. That's if they even survive that. And regardless if they do, they'd still have to either play either the Celtics or the Bucks, and they're not beating either of them. Heat Nation, just go on and take your bow now, because hear me as a fellow Heat fan myself, the season is over. Maybe a hot take, but I feel that as if Spo and Pat Riley needs to go. Spo should be put into the assistant role, and Pat just needs to consider retirement. And as I said, everyone not named Bam and possibly Hero needs to go. Y'all let me know what y'all think about that in the comments.